Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Rocket Power. But I didn't get the grind. Let me try it again. Beach Bandits! Yes, good morning, everyone, and welcome back. Today, we are playing this. We're rollerblading, I don't know. Uh, last episode, yeah, on last episode, uh, we went through the lakes and we beat the Baramundi bot that was, like, you know, terrorizing the waters and stuff. We destroyed that bot and uh, laid waste to the ecosystem. It's great. It's fine. Everything is fine. Everything is okay. But today, we're going to be doing what? Right now, at least. We're doing this. We're playing the Rollerblade mission, training to beat Gollum Jr. because he's a little twerp and he needs to die. Thus saith the king. Thus saith the queen. Man, look at the height I'm getting. Ooh, watch this trick. Ooh, yeah. And now we just, like, do little tricks. Um, yeah. I think this is the, yeah, this is the last, like, level you have to, like, train for. <laughs> I got both of that. I'm actually, actually having to do it. Uh, this is the last, like, level you have to, like, train for because you only have the blades and the skates. All right now. Uh, the, the third thing that you get, you don't, like really trained for we get it at wishing waters which is spoiler alert where we're going next and uh from there we'll have like this third equipment thing sort of but we can't really use it it's difficult to explain you'll you'll see it you'll see it when you believe it and believing is not seeing because believing is polar express seeing yes <laughs> watch the polar express let's play <laughs> that i have on this channel you understand the polar express reference see that kid with the purple helmet no all right we have to break his score um, should be pretty easy to do, because I am great. And, uh, once I get enough de facto speed built up, it will be easy. I almost, <laughs> I almost collapsed. Okay. Didn't get the mythical 10,000, but can I, I can at least get the 6,000. Which, you know, is great, because you only have to do that, like... I it didn't come out. Oh, come on. Come on, give me the 10. You gotta do, like, the starfish last. One, two, three, four. He, why are you doing that? One, two, three, four, one. Ah, that didn't work. It's really difficult to get the four uh, here. You get that, like, mythical 10,000. But you can do uh, that, apparently. The, the For some reason, when you're doing the rollerblades, the second trick... I don't know if it's a bug, but the second trick will, like, not come out. And it's weird. But you'll still get the points for it. Which is kind of sick. So, like, I'm, pr I'm mashing... That time, they both came out. Let me see if I can get it right. No. I guess it's going to work now. Now that the game's going to prove me a liar. But I, you did see it a second ago. Hopefully. You better. You better have seen it. You better have. Uh, but, yeah. There's two minutes left on this. And I've utterly smoked him. There is no way he'll recover. I am flying high. You know how I feel. Michael Buble. But, uh, I'll just skip ahead to when we're done, because it's gonna be me doing tricks for the next minute and 51 seconds. And there we go! What was my score? I think- Oh my gosh! You need- Wow, you need like 20,000 to win and 40,000 points to get the gold coin. 227,995 points. Yo, that might be my best- that might be my best high score. Uh, if, if any of y'all can get your hands on this game, and, uh, or have the game, try to beat that score, and let me know in the comments if you do. I'm curious as to what, like, y'all's scores could be. Uh, because if you can beat mine, I, I'd actually be pretty impressed. <laughs> All right, little twerp man. Worthy opponent, yep. But weirdo, oh, here comes. Got him. <laughs> I love that loser. And then he does an evil laugh that's totally not suspicious. And it, his mouth don't move. Anyway, he leaves. He just scuttles away. And we gotta go talk to Raymundo and, like, get this show on the road. Because we got places to be and people to see. Um, I don't want to change my character. I want to change my vehicle. Here we go. To my knowledge, you don't really have to do much for Ocean Shores Day 2. That was kind of sick, though. That was that was kind of snasty. How was the lakes? Did you? I boy, did we ever? Um, it was. I'm just gonna skip over this because it's not important. 
They're just like repeating stuff that we already did. Well, that's a cool water slide in the background. You see that? That looked pretty cool. Anyway, time to run some errands. Oh, wait, no. We don't. Not yet. We gotta talk to Conroy. That's right. We gotta do this. I'm getting like Ocean Shores Day 3 and Day 2 mixed up. <laughs> They're just walking. Push oh, here comes a call out. Why were you not at training this morning? Yes, drill sergeant! Be really funny if that's what Twister said. He was like, yes, sir! Like they full went full uh drill sergeant here. Conroy Chugga Conroy, there he is. Found him. That is Chugga Conroy. Don't look up what he looks like, because for the longest time, no one did know what he looked like. And we just had to assume what he looked like. Now we know, but don't worry about it, because that's him. That's Chugga Conroy. Right after the banner. Right there. There he is. Chugga A. Conroy. <laughs> Man, he's a he's a YouTuber I've I've like grown up with since like the dawn of since the dawn of my experience on YouTube. He's been one uh, that I've been following, not like religiously anymore, but like still a lot. Um, what what was really shocking was a couple months ago, maybe in like August, the first YouTuber I ever watched uh, hung up his towel, and I guess you could say went home, and that was Maryland. Uh, Mer when Pokemon Diamond and Pearl came out. I was like, you know, really into Pokemon. And I was like, oh man, I want to play the Pokemon game. And I, but I don't know how. So I looked up Maryland.com and I found this, this guy who like had this whole website on how to play the game, like tips and tricks to like beat the game, and that sort of thing. And talked to this guy. Uh, I was like, oh man, he has YouTube videos. So I watched some of his YouTube videos, especially when Black and White came out. And then I found Chugga Conroy from then on, and I guess the rest is, you know, is the history thing. And I, that's how I got into YouTube, was through uh, Maryland and uh, Chugga Conroy. So that's my digressing. Anyway, this is Oliver. He's a nerd, because he wears overalls and has glasses. Otto has glasses, but they're sunglasses, so it's fine. Yeah, he's like, for the right price, I'll let you in. You gotta get into the room where it... Legally, if I say the next word, Disney could sue me. Maybe not legally, but... That could happen. Almost. Didn't say it. Didn't quite say it. Nuh-uh. Ain't gonna get me, Disney. No, 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 no. See Disney over there? See him right there in the corner? Shoo. Get out of here. Get out of here. We don't want ya. <laughs> anyway, 15 coins is the name of the game. We gotta get these bad boys and then head over to the pier and kick Oliver's butt in a game. Because we're gamers. We're built different. Gamers. See, the thing with gamers is uh, they are built different. And uh, people don't think that they are, but they indeed are. Get on the skateboard. I always think how Otto's hair looks like spaghetti. Or rigatoni. Pasta. Looks like pasta. Pasta, if you will. Pasta fajour. Uh, yeah, so we gotta find 15 golden, co golden coins. 15 silver coins. Uh, there are five in this area of Ocean Shores. That mayor is still there. Don't talk to him. Because he will talk your ear off. So we gotta find some coins. Um... And they're, they're all, like, scattered. The way, like, the coins work is for e of the three days of uh, Ocean Shores, the coins are, like, scattered. And they're not in, like, the same place every time you have to find them. And also, new character. There, well, old character. But there he is. I'll let Eddie talk and I'll get back to my point in a minute. Good talk, Eddie. Yeah, Wishing Water. That's where we're going next. And without spoiling it, Wishing Waters is over there. Well, that contradicts what I was saying. <laughs> but yeah, the coins are uh, scattered throughout random parts of uh, Ocean Shores. There isn't like a set place where they are each day. It's not like, oh man, the... Because you saw like the one coin... Yeah, there are 15 silver coins in this area of Ocean Shores. Uh, there's not, like, one... There was the one coin that was on those little, like, playground things. That wasn't there in Ocean Shores Day 1. Each day, like, spawns them... Not completely random, but, like, spawns them in uh, the different spots that go along with each day. So it's not like you can't go to the same spot. Like, there was a coin right there to my right um, on the first day, and now there's not. Also, nice little thing. Um, you can slowly... You can see over the course of, like, the three days, Gollum is, like, buying up more and more of uh, Ocean Shores, and you see, like, his influence uh, as the game progresses. It's really cool. It uh, it gives the world, like, a second, like, not really a second dimension, but, like, a second level. So it's like, oh, man, 
you may not see it because it's a PS2 game and not much can happen and, you know, there's a budget. Uh, but you can actually see stuff changing in the influence of the villain. It's not like, oh yeah, just like believe that he's doing it. It's like, no, he actually is doing it. He's actually gonna take over the world. Go on, take over the world. Okay. So, uh, the 15, we have to get 15 coins, like I was saying. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut ahead to me getting the coins. Um, if there's any, like, hard-to-reach coins, I'll, like, point them out. But, uh, we still have 10 more to get, and I don't want to waste your time looking for coins the whole time. <laughs> so, I will see y'all when we get all of them coins, and we can go do that mission. Alright! So, actually, you know what? Let's do a montage. I haven't had a montage in a good while. Let's, uh, go in 3, 2, 1, let's jam. There we go, 15 coins gathered. Oh my gosh, that took a lot longer than I thought it would. Anyway, time to go talk to Oliver and play a mini game. Woo! So like, you you, you guys, y'all see the gist. You go to Ocean Shores, get 15 coins, play a mini game. But um bum that's it. <laughs> Here we have to get that controller out of his hand to operate some gate at Wishing Waters before we can go anywhere. And in order to do that, we have to kill some aliens. Look at that. Okay. This game. You need 500 you to beat 500 points. 750 to get gold. Oh, how do I play the game? There we go. X. Okay. So each individual alien is worth like different points. 20 are the greens. Rocks are worth uh, 5. Uh, reds are worth uh, 50. The green, Yeah, greens are 20. Yellows are 20. Blues are 10. Uh, you're gonna wanna, wanna always try to go for the reds. Uh, they usually spawn here and there, and maybe up in the air. Yeah, I think the things are five. I am not doing that great. Holy crap. Give me you. Uh, I usually go for the 50s and, like, stay up in the crowds and look for blues and stuff, because it's the easiest way to get points. Getting the 500 is actually the easy part. Getting the 750 can be a bit challenging. But, like, I've played this game, like, <laughs> arguably too much. So I, I, I know how to do it. I uh, get that guy. I say get that guy. Thank you. Get him. Get him. Yeah, it's these it's these fifties that they're not like hard to hit. They'll just you'll you'll be up here like trying to get points, and then all of a sudden you'll see one. And you're like ah, and then they'll despawn, and you're like no. But yeah, so the name of this game is uh, I don't know if it was mentioned or maybe I've just talked over it. It's called The Brains That Ate California. No idea why it's called that. I'll look. I'm, I'll look it up in post, and uh, if I find any information on it, uh, why it's called that, I will put it up on the screen now. And if I didn't, I'll put something up on the screen saying that I couldn't find anything. Anyway, hey, let's keep getting these points. We have cracked 1,200, so anything else is just like way beyond superfluous at this point. I think if that's the right word, it's just extra. Uh, yeah. So I'm just kind of going ham. Uh, like I said earlier. Uh, with the rollerblading thing. Uh, if you, if there's any mission on here that uh, y'all want to play along with and beat my score, feel free and tweet at me, because I'd love to see uh, different like my scores beaten and uh, see how much better y'all at the, at the game are than me. Shoot! Oh, I ran out of time. I was like, why can't I shoot him? But yeah, uh, time is up. I think you have like two minutes or something. Yeah, two minutes. 15-15. We tripled his height score. Easy money! <laughs> well, that one's done. So now, uh, we have the, we got the remote, so we can actually go forward to Wishing Waters. New high score! Yes. I gotta wonder, like, because, because the, 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 uh, the rocket kid, quote-unquote, that plays the mission, 
like, like you're you are so like I'm auto. Uh, it's the one that plays the mission, so I imagine like auto just goes like freaking ham and wrecks him. <laughs> this is the skater dude who's never played a video game before. All of a sudden, like is like he's like going sicko mode <laughs> in the brains that ate California. Oh, that's right. We got to talk to Officer Shirley. Yes, ma'am. Did you go to the lakes? Did you bust that guy down? Uh, we went to the lakes, and uh, there was nothing there. So now we have to go get more evident evidence. I keep thinking that's funny to be like, to remove like the V in some words. Like, because in, in Japanese, the letter V doesn't exist. It's B. It's like when you have Vegeta, it's Vegeta. Not Vegeta. Which makes, which begs the question, is it vegetables? And to that, I would say, yes, it is. Uh, so, I just like doing that. And it's not funny, I just do it because I'm, I'm a quirky gamer girl. <laughs> quirky, quirky girl. Anyway, one more mini game. We got one more to do. Right over here. Talk to these, these nozzles. Hi. It's me. Yo, look at that, that plug walk. Oh! Oh! Got him. I locked Mr. Furry away after the last time you saw him and tried to set him on fire. Jeez. I forgot that's what Twister says. He's like, no, I just locked him away because you set him on fire. Yeah, so, okay, so Lars and uh, Pi and the other guy on the right who has no lines in this whole game is Scud, I think, to my knowledge. It is. Um, They have passes to Wishing Waters, and we need them because... Bus fare isn't free for some reason. That's a different topic for a different day. And we have to get there to, like, progress with the story and thwart the, the guy. Anyway, they're like, Squid, pick up our stink bombs. Bet you can't. And Squid's like, bah, sure. I won't. You're right. And then Twister's like, dude, come, be cool. Be cool, like, for once in your freaking life. I got stuck that because of that freaking CPU. That CPU spawns there every time. And it is so annoying. All right, got that. Gotta get this one. Ugh, ugh. Ugh. I don't know why, but this mission, for some reason, I missed the turn. This reason, this mission, like, the game slows down a lot. I feel like the uh, the frame the frame rate just dips for this mission and this mission alone. I got that first try. And it's really annoying because you're trying to jerk the camera around and it's really difficult. I'm actually struggling with my eyes. There we go. Okay, we're already at 15. This is going along really quick. This jump is really annoying. Just gotta line it up just right. And I did. And we circle back around and that's it. Wow, this this went... Oh, that's right. The, you gotta pass the first car and... There we go. That mission used to tr that that jump used to trip me up as a kid like a lot. I'd be like, "Yo, pass the first car and get the second car," and you just uh, pull up. Minute seventeen. That was quick. Wow, man, this is like the mini game episode. We're just doing mini game after mini game after mini game. Feels like Mario Party. Dun 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 dun. dun. Miss. And then Squid drops the stink bombs on the ground. Here's your bus passes, dude. And then they just blow up inexplicably. And they run away, but the rocket kids are like, mm, we're fine. And then uh, you just go. And there's the bus. I don't know why they take a school bus. I, I really don't know why it's a school bus. Why it's not like an actual bus. I will never know. And also, their models are not on the bus. I have many questions about this game sometimes. <laughs> but who am I to say? Also, look at that new screen. The new the new red. I love that red and orange and brown. It looks so nice. Anyway, here we are at Wishing Waters, the water park. Which is kind of a lame water park when you look at it. When you get like, really into it. Uh, but we're going to actually cut it here. I'm going to cut it here, actually. Uh, for this episode... 
Uh, thank you all so much for watching. Uh, so today we actually got through Ocean Shores Day 2, and we're going to be moving forward with Wishing Waters. Like, uh, robots, I'm going to pause. <laughs> so thank you all so much for watching. Uh, like the video if you enjoyed it. Comment down below. I love reading them. And don't forget to subscribe. It really helps me out when you all do. and it, it means a lot to me as well. Uh, so yeah, I will see you all next time on another episode of Rocket Power... Dodge the robots. Rocket Power Beach Bandits. Yeah. Ow. <laughs>